Bosch's Biogenesis Clinic originally flagged for distributing illegal drugs to professional athletes back in January. Uh, but players like A-Rod denied a connection. So how critical is Tony Bosch's cooperation to nailing these players accused of using performance-enhancing drugs? Uh, well, Christine, I think that uh, Bosch is absolutely critical. I mean, he's everything to Major League Baseball's case against these 20 or so players. Uh, when you look at the fact that Tony Bosch could bring forth sworn testimony, that he could bring forth uh, evidence, and this could go as far as phone records, this could go as far as receipts, this is go, we, we know that there's been some handwritten notes out there since January that have implicated these names and incomplete, incompleted these, uh, these players. So he's the connection, he's the missing link, and he could be the smoking gun, if you will, uh, for Major League Baseball to, to have a strong case against these 20 uh, or so players. Joe, why is he cooperating now, do you think? Why has he changed his tune? Well, I think it's because Tony Bosch has been essentially backed into a corner. I mean, he needs Major League Baseball as much as Major League Baseball needs him. Uh, right now, Major League Baseball is threatening a massive lawsuit against Tony Bosch. So he has no opportunity to, or money or finances or uh, a, a power to fight Major League Baseball's lawsuit. His clinic is closed. He's broke. Apparently, he's living with family and friends. So his options there are very limited. He also could possibly be facing criminal charges. Major League Baseball is saying, you cooperate with us, you bring us your evidence, you tell us everything you know, and not only will we stop our lawsuit and drop our lawsuit against you, we'll also provide you protection hmm. for any harm that might be out there, and we'll also put in a good word to any law enforcement agencies that might be bringing criminal charges against you. So really, Tony Bosch has very few options out there right now. And of course, baseball needs him because there are no positive tests. They need his corroborating testimony and documents, whatever he has, to prove anything. Joe, one of the things I was surprised by is they're talking about 100-game yeah. suspensions for A-Rod and Ryan Braun. That's what you get for a second offense. How can they justify that, Major League Baseball? Well, Major League Baseball is basically saying we're gonna, it's going to be a two-strike policy here, that one strike is for the link to performance-enhancing drugs. The second strike would be for lying about it or denying it. So 50 games for the first strike, 50 games for the second strike. That's 100 games for two former MVPs, Alex Rodriguez, Ryan Braun. This is unprecedented. 